In this video, we are going to discuss about gene cloning and the steps involved in this process and its basic applications. What is gene cloning? Gene cloning is a process which includes set of experimental methods at the level of molecular biology, mainly used to set together the recombinant DNA molecules and to perform the replication within the host organism. These are the steps involved in gene cloning. First, isolation of donor DNA fragment or gene. Next, selection of suitable vector. And then, incorporation of donor DNA fragment into vector. And transformation of recombinant vector into suitable host cell. And the last step is isolation of recombinant host cell. Here we can see. This is a bacterial cell containing chromosome and plasmid. Plasmid is a type of vector and it is small, circular, double standard extra chromosomal DNA molecule of some bacterial species. In order to incorporate donor DNA fragment into suitable vector, first we need to select a cell with DNA containing gene of interest. After that, we need to isolate DNA from that cell and extract the gene of interest. Next, we need to isolate plasmid from bacterial cell. Unlike the much larger bacterial chromosome, plasmids are quite resistant to permanent denaturation. The steps involved in isolation of plasmid are first, lysis and denaturation, next, neutralization and centrifugation. After isolating donor DNA from the cell, cut the cell's DNA with the same restriction enzyme which is used in cutting plasmid DNA to isolate gene of interest from the donor DNA. Cut the plasmid in its recognition site with the help of same restriction enzyme used in isolating gene of interest. After cutting the plasmid in its recognition site, we will get plasmid with sticky ends or blunt ends depending upon the type of restriction enzyme used. Combine gene of interest which is isolated from the donor DNA and plasmid which is isolated from the bacterial cell to form a recombinant DNA. Use DNA ligases to paste together bases with respect to the covalent bonds. After inserting the gene of interest into plasmid vector, put the plasmid vector back into the bacterial cell by transformation. Now the recombinant bacterium is produced. When the bacterial cell divides, all the daughter cells receive the recombinant plasmid, which again replicates in each daughter cell. After successful rounds of cell division, visible colonies will form. Here we can see uh, the bacterial cell reproducing clone of cells. Applications of gene cloning Medicine applications Mainly used in the synthesis of antibiotics, vitamins and hormones and also used in treatment of diseases. Clone genes mainly used in the production of industrial enzymes and pharmaceutical drugs. Agricultural applications. Desired genes are used to increase the crop productivity and health and also better in nutrition value. Gene therapy. Replacement of a defective gene by inserting a healthy gene is called gene therapy. Diseases like leukemia and sickle cell anemia can be treated. Genomic library. From a gene library, it is possible to identify a clone containing the specific gene. Base sequence in this gene can be found. From the base to sequence, the sequence of amino acids in a polypeptide can be worked out on the basis of the triplet code. 